title, Seeking Understanding Through Inquiry. My dear viewers, Assalamu Alaikum everyone. Today in this hadith, we will explore important lessons on seeking knowledge, understanding accountability in the hereafter, and the value of active learning. I seek Allah's protection from the rejected Satan, devil. In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. Chapter 36 Whoever heard something, but did not understand it, and then asked again, till he understood it, completely, had it. Narrated Ibn Abu Mulaika, whenever I saw the wife of the Prophet, peace be upon him, heard anything, which she did not understand, she used to ask again, till she understood it completely. Aisha said, once the Prophet peace be upon him said, whoever will be called to account, about his deeds on the day of resurrection, will surely be punished, I said, doesn't Allah say, he surely will receive an easy reckoning. Surah number 84. Surah number 84. Surah al anshakak the sundering, verse number 8 in Arabic and translation English is Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Fasawfa yuhasabu hisaban yaseera. They will have an easy reckoning. The Prophet peace be upon him replied, This means only the presentation of the accounts but whoever will be argued about, his account will certainly be ruined. Key lesson from the Hadith 1. Importance of understanding Aisha's radiallahu anha example teaches us the importance of seeking complete understanding. When she heard something she did not fully grasp, she would ask for clarification until she understood it entirely. This emphasizes the value of not hesitating to seek further knowledge and clarity, especially in matters of religion and important teachings. 2. Clarification on accountability The Hadith touches upon the concept of being called to account on the day of resurrection. The Prophet peace be upon him explains that those who are merely presented with their accounts will have an easier time, whereas those who are debated or argued about their accounts will face punishment. This distinction highlights the seriousness of our actions and the importance of striving to lead a righteous life. 3. Engagement and learning. The interaction between Aisha radiallahu anha and the Prophet peace be upon him serves as a model for effective learning. It shows that active engagement, questioning, and seeking explanations are key components of gaining deeper knowledge. As students, it's crucial to approach learning with curiosity and the willingness to ask questions, ensuring that we fully understand the teachings and can apply them correctly in our lives. Conclusion By reflecting on this hadith, we learn the significance of seeking knowledge, the nuances of accountability in the hereafter, and the importance of active learning. This approach helps us to grasp religious teachings better and implement them meaningfully in our daily lives. Dear viewers, thank you so much for watching and supporting my channel. I hope today's hadith offered valuable lessons. Please share your thoughts in the comments if you learned something new. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell for daily updates. May Allah grant you happiness, good health, and a long life. May He protect and bless our brothers and sisters in Palestine and bring peace to their land. Amin. Dear viewers, take great care of yourselves and those around you. Stay happy and spread joy. Allah Hafiz.